attempting to ease unrest in Missouri, Attorney General Eric Holder is in Ferguson tonight to oversee the federal investigation into the deadly police shooting of an unarmed teenager. This has protesters call for the lead investigator to step aside. CBS 2's Marley Hall reports. Protesters gathered outside the prosecutor's office as a grand jury began hearing evidence in the deadly police shooting of an unarmed teenager in Ferguson, Missouri. They will have absolutely everything that there is, um, every piece of paper, every photograph. Arrest Darren Wilson! Prosecutors expect it will take the grand jury until mid-October to decide whether Officer Darren Wilson should be charged with killing Michael Brown. Some protesters are calling for the removal of Prosecutor Bob McCullough because of his ties to police. His father was killed in the line of duty 50 years ago. The DA needs to step down because he, can, he can't be unbiased. You know, he has cousins and family members on the police force. I think he's too close to the case. But McCullough says losing his father only made him more compassionate, and he does not plan to step aside. I know the pain that the Brown family is going through right now. We want to help as best we can. U.S. Attorney General Eric Holder is in Ferguson meeting with the community and getting a first-hand look at the federal investigation into Brown's death. The shooting has triggered more than a week of violence in the predominantly black suburb. Last night, some protesters threw bottles and police used pepper spray, but it was more subdued than previous nights. In Clayton, Missouri, Marley Hall, CBS2 News. And the funeral for Michael Brown will be held on Monday.